Like most of our superhero friends, the Wasp was created by Marvel legends Stan Lee and Jack Kirby, first appearing in Tales to Astonish in 1963 as Ant-Man's sidekick. Like Ant-Man, the Wasp's powers also come from pin particles, which allow her to shrink and grow. But she's got a few things that set her apart. You gave her wings and blasters. And those blasts tend to sting. Evangeline Lilly's version of the Wasp, Hope Van Dyne, is actually the second generation of the character. Michelle Pfeiffer's Janet Van Dyne was the original, but currently she's nowhere to be found. Well, so we think. Now, like we said, the Wasp and Ant-Man go way back, all the way to the origin of the character. So that makes this big screen reunion that much bigger, or I mean, technically smaller. But unlike other famous duos, there's a little more going on here. Because Ant-Man teamed up with Captain America in Civil War, the Wasp and her dad, Dr. Hank Pym, find themselves outlaws as well. Let's go. They will be facing some obstacles along the way, as the enigmatic ghost makes her Marvel Cinematic Universe debut. Though it looks like they won't be alone, thanks to some familiar faces. That's us. And some new ones. Ant-Man and the Wasp teaming up. What does this mean for the future of the MCU? I guess we'll have to wait and find out. Check out Ant-Man and the Wasp in theaters July 6th.